my internship with ACE felt like a very kind of accessible gateway into um, government work or this kind of field work. We work really closely with the interns. They are a vital part of our team. If we didn't have them, we would be very out of luck because they, they are the smarts, they're the hands, they're everything that a good crew needs to do this sort of sampling. They bring a lot of good intuition and knowledge to the group. Using electrofishing technology, we have three passes that we do to create what we call a depletion curve. So we're, we're actually monitoring mostly for game fish, which it, in this park is brook trout. Electric fishing is basically the process of stunning the fish to the point where it can't actually use their muscles. It's a non-lethal process. So it will recover within about 30 seconds to a minute, I'd say. And then you can release them, distribute them equally throughout the transect. So we weigh each fish, we measure each fish. 104. We record each fish just to get a sample size and kind of weight distribution and that sort of thing for each stream so we can see what our population is. And it's just important to monitor the populations and assess the diversity of the streams to just make sure that what we're doing here is, is working and we have healthy systems. I definitely think I'm very well versed in electrofishing methods by now just by being able to crack at it every single day. So my field experience has definitely increased a lot. I would just say overall knowledge of just fisheries research. Prior to this, I never really did something as, as professional as this before. Learning how to work as a team would definitely be a big part of it, and I think that'll help as a fisheries scientist in the making.